Hi planner girls and guys. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Gabby and you're watching my channel. I call Gabby Quiet Girl. This week I am using a kit from the Sugary Gal Shop. It's called their Sweet Panda Planner Kit. I'll have the link included in the description box below. But this is a nice soft blue, periwinkle blue and it kind of goes with the kit there. So um, I'm going to go ahead and flip through the kit here. It comes with everything that you need to plan, heart checklist, bottom washi, full boxes, and some headers. So these are some of the washies that I'll use in conjunction with some of the other stickers that came with the kit and also my handy dandy felt tip thick pen. So pretty much I'm flipping over my planner to get started and I'm starting with the bottom washi and uh, the more I go the harder it is to flip the planner over um, because I did get the 18 month planner so my planner is not done until December of this year so I still have a few months before I have to decide what sort of planner I'm going to stick with if it's going to be an Erin Condren, a Recollections brand or just going full-fledged happy planner. As you can see I put down the bottom washi and I'm going to the sidebar to set it to use some of these cute little iridescent dots washi sticker washi tape and um, it's hard to see because of the lighting but um, you'll be able to see it um, and it, I put down a full box that said life is not always black and white which it's not there's a bunch of grays in there and you guys can probably see a little bit better uh, some of the iridescent portion of the washi tape that I'm putting down that I'm pretty much bordering that full box From there, I'm putting down a weekly tracker for the daily goals that I had set for myself for this week. And these, um, I want to start tracking just for professional goals that I have and everything like that. And that's pretty much what I really wanted to um, start tracking, whether it's something as much as like smile 50 times today or something like that. That's something that I wanted to get in the habit of tracking as well. So I put down my washi tape and then I put down a little quarter box and then a full heart checklist here. And that was also to track some of the spiritual goals that I had set for myself because not everything is about getting money and you know and all of that. Sometimes it's just about building a better you. So that's something I'm not going to write those goals pretty much during this plan with me. But um, I went ahead and put that down to track later on. I put down some more washi tape. And I filled out my daily goals. And yes, as you can see, one of my daily goals was staying awake. And I do apologize. Some of my uh, nail polish on my hand had chipped off. I try and film the plan with me as soon as I do my manicure. I haven't been boycotting nail salons and getting gel polish. But I felt like it made my nails really weak. And I wanted my nails to get stronger again. So, you know, you do the dishes a couple of times. And here comes the chips <laughs> for the nail polish. So that's what happened there. So for Monday the 17th, I put down a blue to-do header list. And I saw that some of the other pen had bled through from last week. So I knew I wanted to cover that with the full box heart checklist. Excuse me so I just wrote down some of the stuff that I wanted to do um, catching up with family working out that's some of the things I wanted to do and I also wanted to just um, look at YouTube and just see where uh, else I wanted to start taking my channel for growth I wanted to make my lunch and I just haven't been feeling well with due to allergies I don't know if some people can hear it in my voice if you can't that's completely fine I'm not trying to go for pity points it's just, um, I just have to take a nap after I do some of the tasks I have to do for uh, for the day before I head to work because it, it's just really hard. Um, but um, I ended up putting down this beautiful blue uh, multicolored washi and it has 
a pattern on it that has iridescent an iridescent pattern on it so um, I put a half box on there and um, I just laid it on top and I just said that I needed to go to Walmart before I went to work and then I put a beautiful full box beautiful flower to end out Monday before I went into Tuesday with the today header and I put in a quarter box or a banner sticker however you want to call it I just said that I want to go on a morning walk I had that day off so there were some errands that I wanted to run in particular I decided that I wanted to use this banner sticker type washi and then at the last minute I changed it even though I had whited out the header and was putting down something else I was putting down another like half box saying that I want to take a nap and I used an Icone Shop uh, Panda for that and then for the little girl there that uh, looks like she's kind of like straddling that's from Also Paper when I put down the to do header and the full heart checklist I knew I wanted to fill my plan with me do some reading writing and then catch up on some DVR recording while I did some preliminary editing on the video that I was gonna film and again like as promised I pulled up that other washi tape and used some washi tape I used last week which was the pineapple one I thought it fit better and I couldn't decide so I decided to put some more confetti washi tape as well just to kind of accentuate that area because um, those two washi tapes had every color that was included in the kit so I thought it was a good match from there I went on to Wednesday I put up this beautiful full box and it was of a panda of course and I wanted to position it so I didn't have to keep ripping stuff up and putting it down you guys know what happens when that keeps happening <laughs> but um, after I put down that full box panda I covered up the header with another to, uh, to do header or correction a little things header from the kit and from there I put down another full box checklist heart checklist and whenever I thought I had it positioned well I went ahead and wrote down some of the other tests I had to do and this has been probably like a month or two with me writing right side up so I'm actually pretty proud of that because when I first started I felt like it was slanting up and I'd always been writing towards the side, but I'd say, you know, challenge yourself. It may not be perfect the first time you do something, but it's always worth it to try. Life is too short for you to be afraid to try something that you really want to do. So that's my advice uh, to those who are straddling the fence on any area of your life. Just go for it. But as you can see, my big pen ran out. So I used my, is it Statler? Statler? I'm not really quite sure how to pronounce the pen, but it's another felt tip pen. That's Sattler or something. And um, I continued to write down some of the things that I need to do for that day. Um, besides working out, packing lunch, I wanted to um, post some stuff on Instagram and do some other reading. And I wanted to continue on with doodling. Um, I just never realized how cathartic some of those things were so that always works um, I put down a today header and I was picking up another full box from the kit this one has a beautiful pink and blue flowers and try to situate it on there well sometimes it's easier to put the full box on than put the header so that's something I kind of learned the hard way as you can see that I ended up readjusting some things there and um, because this was plain but um, it wasn't plain because I had decoration but it wasn't one of those stunning decorations to where you didn't want to put anything out else on there so I put this beautiful Girls Night Out sticker on there. I believe that's from 
mochi plans. Either way, I'm gonna include that in the description box below. And then I put a Kone Shop panda on there to close out that particular box of him waving. So I thought that was, or it could be a girl panda, you know. Yeah, so I put a panda on there just to uh, close out Wednesday and um, I just looked some things over, make sure everything was to my liking and um, decided to go on ahead and plan out the second half of the week. I think I ended up covering up the page flags in the end. It was with one of the banner stickers I decided to use to cover up. The page flag and when I flipped it over I noticed which I was like oh my gosh there was like this mark on my desk that I wasn't even aware of and it completely ruined Friday and I was like I can't even continue to plan noticing that there's a, a like a marker mark on my paper so I think it was lip liner don't ask me how it got there <laughs> but anyways I went ahead put down the bottom washi I put down a page flag and I also put down a header on Thursday with another half box so I said I was gonna weigh in today I think what ended up happening because um, I was doing this like little health challenge or whatever at my job the weight at the job was stolen and I had a family member hide the scale at my house because I keep weighing myself too many times and so I was like you know let me just coast without knowing my weight and you know just try and do uh be better um I haven't eaten healthy all the time but I mean it's a work in progress so I'm proud of the progress I have so far but back to this plan with me here um I put down another header and another heart checklist and I put down that I was gonna I needed to budget out my money do some doodling I wanted to see if I can make a car appointment because I need to get my checked tags change and I wanted to go out with uh, to, to get takeout with my sister which we ended up doing so I put another little mochi plants uh, sticker there as well for Friday I put down a today header a half box sticker and um, I put down a plan out money because it was a payday so I used the Kone shop elephant there to indicate that it was payday and yes, I have to budget my money because God knows it will go into more planner supplies. <laughs> and then I'll be like, well, what happened was when my bills come around and I'm like, you know, you can't do that, you know. But sometimes it feels like you're just always paying stuff that you need and it's like a rarity that you can get what you want. But I think that's everybody. But I'm still very blessed and, and grateful for what I do have. So I put down on Friday that I worked out. Um, and that um, I was checking up on some other projects that I had to do and um, double checking on my auto pay and then I put down some other bills that were due that day and I needed to charge my camera battery because I needed to do some filming. For Saturday I put down a to-do sticker and I was going for my morning walk. I put down a full box sticker for that and I put two little multi-plan um, coffee cups. I layered some washi tape, the iridescent dots on there. I put the weekend banner on there and then put down another full box checklist just listing some of the other things I need to do for Saturday and who I want to catch up with and I how I need to organize my laundry because on Sunday I know I was going to end up doing laundry as well and um I had some family members come into town, so um, the plan was to go to the movies, but I think we just ended up chilling at the house, which to me never gets old, you know, because it's more about the company of having people there than going and spending money, you know, and sometimes I, I think one of the things I really like about when I have like my family and my sisters around is that you never feel the need that, to really have to spend money to have a good time. It's just good company with good people, so... Um, on Sunday, I put uh, down another full box panda sticker, a to-do header, and, well, that's a little thing sticker. And I put down a little quarter box there and a two-heart checklist 
I wrote down that I wanted to sleep in and uh, that I wanted to have some brunch with the family and enjoy that time. And that was pretty much um, it. I put down another full box sticker from there and that com pretty much completes out the spread here. Um, this took a way a lot less time planning because it was a kit. Um, so it was always fun to sprinkle in every now and again. And I put down some other little decorative stickers. But this is pretty much a completed spread, you guys. I really enjoyed using this spread. Um, always like and subscribe. And thank you guys for watching.